Hi again, everybody. It is Thursday, September 15th, halfway through September. I uh, just want to review some of the timing window hits from the last couple days. Let's back up to uh, Tuesday. We had the small A1 window lining up with the um, big sell-off around 8.30. That was coincidental with the... Uh, inflation report that came out that sent this thing into a, that tailspin and then the, I mentioned the timing window for the afternoon and you can see that we came in on the green A1 over the larger A2 white block which this is fairly common uh, as I mentioned numerous times when you get the opposite color combination together and that ended up being the low of the day Got a bounce there late, not a whole lot, but there was a small trade in there. And then looking to um, yesterday, we had a long, quiet, flat spot. We had an important window right here. It ended up uh, around 2.08. We got that low in the white A1, bright green A2 window, which triggered off a good long. So if you're in the uh, European time zone, you probably got that one. And then later in the afternoon yesterday, we got the white A2 with the green A1, which got yesterday's low and triggered off a nice move into the uh, close of that session. You could have got this at about uh, 39.40, and that went up to the low 70s. So that was... a uh, 30 point potential there at the end of the day so just want to point that out again there you see two lows of days back to back in our white uh, windows confirmed by the smaller bright green window and you're gonna see that this is very consistent and happens all the time uh, I want to mention my price lines now these price lines are not new these price lines are carried over from early September when we uh, were trading in this range as the market started moving upward in its uh, last rally. So if you go back and look at my prior videos, I think I put this out there when I uh, put these lines on the chart. I put those out and you can see how the market has a memory and the levels that were important then are still important now every key pivot as the market was trading in this area every key pivot was made off of these lines so uh, those price lines are not part of the perfect storm that's something new that I developed it's part of the hidden phi method but uh, I'll be putting that information out soon I think so we'll see what happens with that Anyhow, that's it for today. Thanks for watching, and we'll be back again tomorrow.